Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Mario Galaxy after a Here year. Here we go. It is me, Dan of Drunk Town. It's -a me, Luigi. You wish. I want to let me die. <laughs> you wish you were Luigi. Look, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a corpse of my former self. Hey, what's up? I'm Carl. Yeah, it's Carl. Uh, I I'm spinning my fidget right now. I locked him in the basement to record more Mario. Please yeah. don't hit me with the fidget again. Last time, I I don't even remember what, where we were last time. So the last time, <laughs> but last time uh, a lot of things weren't the way they were now. Uh yeah. No wait, are we talking? Like, are we going real talk here, or are we just going joke talk? Because if we're going real talk, this is gonna get a little depressing for Mario. <laughs> but then again, when hasn't it? On the one hand, uh, politics. On the other hand, uh, fidget spinners didn't exist. This is true. I mean, they probably existed, but they weren't mainstream. Let's begin. So, t take everything as you will. No matter what, remember, pet rocks were a terrible idea, and I don't know why they ever existed. Chapter 6, Pet Rocks. Then Father came day. home with a, with a pet rock for me, so I threw it at his face and called him a retard. <laughs> Jesus fuck! That escalated quickly! From the planet, another loom of the same color emerged. Do you do you two know each other? Why you assume we know each other because we're the same color? We ain't even really the same color. Look at us. I'm yellow, he pink. Oh, I get it. Just because we star people, we know each other, huh? Oh, I get it, you fucking racist. Oh, I see how it is. What's wrong with Look us? Look at their tiny mouths. Look at her tiny fingers. Like she's a child, Dan. What do you fucking expect? Listen. Big fingers? Listen, she's got a. You want her to like... have man hands? <laughs> My friends used to call me man hands or Zelina. Oh, I was a nut. She man takes off her gloves. It's just these huge fucking yaoi like, hands. It's like giant. It's like giant, like Donkey Kong hands, but the rest of the body is proportioned to a child. Fucking terrifying. Remember when we used to read these instead of ramble about nonsense about the art? Oh, I don't need Audacity open, do I? Oh, yeah, you don't need it open. I'm, I have all the recordings. Drunken Daniel does everything himself because he's a fucking fag. Oh, what? Rude. She'll have to name every single one of you. You're Blippy, you're Dippy, you're Skippy, you're Mippy. Stinky. You're Dot. Why am I not? Because I hate you the most. Bounce, bounce, and the claw. If anyone gets that reference, you you, um, you got the reference. Congratulations. All right, let me look at the map and see where I should go. <laughs> oh, where should you go, Dan? You probably should have watched your own series. What? Prepare? You, you, you think I'm a professional or something? Nah. Oh, so I just need six, ten, and then we pretty much have a uh, thing, and so I can go any of these places. Yeah, you can uh, go and finish this game, and you can 100% uh, it. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Why not? Gerard's doing it. Why aren't you doing it? My name is Drunken Dan, not the pizza pleasionist. Yeah, oh, that's right, your name's Pussy Boy. The yeah. boy who's afraid of completing games. Yeah. You see, well, you see, what happened was... I tried to complete a game once. It was bad, rats. The game bugged out and didn't give me my achievements. Why would you ever do that? Because the achievements were simple. It was literally just beat the game. Why would you ever do that? I did the entire. I know game. you're the the self crowned king of bad rats. They denied me my crown. I am the no same way that fucking Markiplier is the self titled king of Five Nights at Freddy's. At least. At least it didn't take. At least, um. <laughs> at least Pad Rats is a good game. <laughs> Fuck. You said it, not me. Wow! It rem Honestly, like, Five Nights at Freddy's is like those fucking, like, Flash games I see on Newgrounds that would do pretty much the same damn thing. I mean, it started out pretty strong with the first one, and the second one added too many things, and the third one was fucking trash, and the fourth one was fucking trash. 
And sister location was actually pretty alright. A sister location looks good, actually. Like, not even gonna lie. Honestly, it was actually one of the scarier ones because it focused more on using uh, most of your other senses. And by that, I mean, you know, audio with visual. Instead of just, like... <coughs> all right. Yeah, instead of it just being like you're in this one spot, it has a bunch of different things for you to do, so you're not just repeating the same action over and over. I think they're ever gonna make a Five Nights at Toads. No, Nintendo would never do that. Don't even retweet that good toad that I see going around. Shit. Okay, so I gotta break something here. Don't mind me, I'm just, I'm just, I'm uncoordinated. Crash Bandicoot just came out. I wanna play it, leave me alone. I, I still need to get it. I don't know, Amazon PR. They also sent me like some random code on Amazon for the game, and I have no idea what like that game would have that would have a download code. Ah! Why why are they trying to shoot me? It's a me, Mario. Leave me alone. Please! No! Pick at the children! An orange? A green star? Oh, I can't take that. It's green. What the? Did I just, like, find an alternate path on accident? Oh, uh, you probably did. <laughs> that looks exactly like what it was. <laughs> I, I mean, I know what I'm doing, exactly! What are you talking about? I'm a genius at video games. <laughs> Secret of- oh, it was a hidden star, yeah. I mean, I, I knew it was a hidden star, I knew that going in. I'm actually a genius. You Dan has actually me. mapped out everything in this episode. Oh, yeah, yeah. Everything was planned out according to uh, a plan. Yeah, you see, this is all uh, being done in post-recording, so he knows everything that's gonna happen now, he's just acting. Yep, this is all post. I, I, Remember I when you used to do post? I, I used to do that a lot, I do it occasionally now. I tried it once, and I was like, this is awful. <laughs> the, the, the benefit of post is that you can um, kind of come up with commentary ahead of time, but you... Oh, you mean you script your videos? No. Wow, drunk... You you heard it here for her first, folks. I had a stroke for a second. But also, you heard it here first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Drunken Dan yeah, 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 yeah. scripts his videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I gotta get another one over there. I'm reading a script right now. He's telling me to say all this stuff. You see, it's right here. Carl, how could you tell them? My secrets. Ha 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 ha. Candle after. Ha ha. Disappointed. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, ha. I was supposed to... Oh. You know, we're ignoring the... We're, we're like half ignoring the text here. Yet I'm probably still reading more than certain LP groups. Listen, don't make. call me out like this. What? What? Wait, wait, what? No, seriously, what? 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 <laughs> you don't read? Sometimes sometimes I just like, oh yeah, I know what I'm doing, and then it ends and I go, fuck, wait. <laughs> do, do you then blame the game, though? I d no, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I do, and then I'm like, oh god, I'm as bad as, bad as fucking Aaron. One of the most Cause I, Because I'm not a big fancy YouTube editor, I... I'm not a big fan editor. Since I'm not a big fancy YouTuber. I don't have my own editor. I edit my own shit. So when I notice that like there's something that I missed in the game that's like you should do this, and I didn't read it, I'm like, oh my god, I hate this so much. Yeah, and editing can be fun to just poke fun at yourself when that oh, happens. I I do that a lot. I'll put in text. It's like it's right fucking there, you idiot. What are you doing? Even better if you're like I can't see it, and then you just zoom in on the uh, thing that you're missing, like a clown. It's even better when I, like, notice what I'm supposed to do and I go, wow, I'm fucking stupid, and I put up a little text thing that says, you got that right. <laughs> One thing I started doing in editing, like, for games, like, when I was doing Bad Rats is whenever there's that period of time where I'm just kind of sitting there staring at the screen, like, okay, what the fuck do I do? I just started doing, like, the fucking Spongebob transition. <laughs> the last episode was, I did a lot of that because there was a lot of periods and we just kind of the game just bugging, glitching out. I think at one point I used the, uh, 70 years later effect. 70 years later. No, no, it's like, it, it wasn't even by the regular guy. It was, um, oh, what's his name? Tim Curry. Ah. Uh. 
doing like a uh, the uh, the Nigel Thornberry voice. Seventeen years later. Okay, so I keep. I keep forgetting that fucking Tim Curry was fucking Nigel Thornberry. I keep forgetting Tim Curry was things other than Nigel Thornberry. I keep forgetting that Tim Curry's still alive. That's fair. Considering, you know, he had a terrible stroke and he's, like, basically dead. That, I didn't know that. That's really sad, actually. It's, it's awful. If you look at pictures of him now, he just... It's awful to say, but he just looks like a fucking idiot. He's like, Ugh. And it's nothing he can control because he had a fucking stroke. So it's like, it's awful. So there's pictures of him just in a wheelchair. Oh, okay. It's like, I see. Well, I see what I got here. It's upsetting. It makes me uh, want like to cry. I like Tim Curry as the, uh, as the leader of the Russians. You know, you know the one from. from uh, <laughs> Spice! Spice! The one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space! Bye. I love that so much. That's the best part of that game. How old is he? He's fucking 71. Boy. He's, he's getting up there. I'm scared. Oh, hold on. Let me uh, get some air. I, I thought one of the cannons went off, but it didn't. Yeah, he had a stroke in uh, June 2012. Damn. So now he's wheelchair bound. That's sad. It is. I don't know if he could still, like, do half of his voices. I would, I, would, I would hazard a guess, probably not. I love, like, he has all these, like, awards for, like, best actor, stage actor of the year, outstanding performer in a children's series, and then just one that's worst supporting actor. Jesus Christ. That the escalated Raz quickly. Yeah, and a fucking a singular Razzie award for his role in Congo. No, no, the diamonds are here. God, Tim Curry's so great. I love it. You know what? I, I don't even think he should. He deserved that Razzie because he was the best part of that crappy movie. Whenever Tim Curry's in something, it doesn't matter how good or bad it is, he makes it. Let's see, do they have a filmography for him? I, you know who should have done the- if he, if he could still do the voice is- I would, You know who would have been a perfect Dio Brando? Oh him. god, yes. That would have been fucking great. His idea. Like, everyone of course knows him from fucking Rocky Horror Picture Show. I remember he was the slime creature in Ferngully. <laughs> yeah. Or he was monster. also, uh, he was also Mozart in, uh, Amadeus. Well, because whatever, because what, the two things I think about him are Nigel Thornberry and that fucking slime monster, because I just hear in my head, specifically, synced up to Nigel fucking Thornberry, the slime beneath me. Oh, I forgot he was in fucking Annie, also. He's in a lot of shit. There's Ferngully. Home Alone 2, Lost in New York. Pebble and the Penguin. Ugh. Muppet Treasure Island. Oh my god, that's right, he was Long John Silver. Dude, we're having an adventure today. Mario featuring Tim Curry. He was fucking Gomez Adams in the Adams Family Reunion? Huh. Wow, I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. We're learning things today. He was a sumo singer in Rugrats in Paris, the movie. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's real good. You know, that does remind me, real talk, I've never seen any of the Rugrats movies. Uh, good. Oh, shit. And the Wild Thornberry's movie and Rugrats Go Wild. Dude, he was the voice of El Malefico in Mucha Lucha, the return of El Malefico. <laughs> Jesus. He's been in a lot of shit, man. Yeah, he, a lot of them, he's been a king. He's got the voice for it. Yeah. Mythic okay. Journeys, the king. Scooby-Doo and the Goblin King, the Goblin King. The Chosen One, Lucifer. Oh, that's where that line comes from, the evil seed of what you've done. Is that fucking really? Yeah, that's where that comes from. 
That's pretty good. Evil seed of what you've done germinates within you. Yeah, it's my that's favorite. It's, it's, it was a great line until Gun Angel killed it. That's an inside reference. It's okay, guys, if you don't get it. Woo! Rest in peace, Gun Angel. Oliver Twit. Eh. <laughs> yeah! It's a pun! Dude, he's in a lot of shows, too. What the fuck? I, I need to close this. I'm falling into a deep rabbit hole. Look at this video game. I haven't talked about that in, since the start of the game. Neither have I! <laughs> We're both guilty. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, Welcome back controls. to Game Grumps. Mario Odyssey! Odyssey, you see? Okay. Yeah, good. Question. Do you think that in the song they're saying Odyssey, you see? Or Odyssey, you see? Uh, like, are they saying uh, you see? Or I are they saying. I, I heard it as uh, 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 Odyssey, let's see, for some reason. Oh, uh, well, then you're fucking. So I, I'm even weirder. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm, you are. I'm really wrong. Because I can't tell if they're just repeating the last bit of Odyssey with EC, or if they're saying Yossi. I, I think I it's like see, a. It could be Yossi because you know, kind of like it's like the, uh, like style like the nineteen like twenties kind of swinging music. So it could be that. Also, I never realized I went Pauline back into a game until now. I was like, yeah, there she is. I was like, what, what, what? They made Pauline a thing. They made her something I actually care about. Son of a bitch. Like. She was in the, uh, the mini games. You know, the Mario mini, Donkey Kong mini, whatever the fuck. Yeah. I March of the she, minis and all that yeah, shit. She, like, she owned, like, the uh, toy factory. Yeah. But, like, other than that, she didn't really do much. So it was kind of... Yeah, she was just kidnapped, just like in Donkey Kong. Yeah. Where now she's like the mayor of a city and ha is a lead singer of a jazz band. Odyssey, you see? Anyway, this song is so fucking good. Tune in next time for more Mario Galaxy. Tune in next time when there Pauline won't be a. Uh, yeah, tune in next time where there won't be a fucking good song in this fucking game. <laughs> <laughs>